Good morning, Huskies. Today is Wednesday, November 7th, and I am Renicia. And I am Angelina, celebrating our canned food drive. But before we begin, please stand for our nation's pledge. You're not one of those people who say the world can't be changed. You. You believe that it's everybody's duty to give the world a reason to dance, right? We have a whole world to make more awesome. People, we need you. We really need you. Kids, people used to be kids. Everybody. But how, Key President? Everything's terrible. Hey, quiet you. I know, sometimes things can look pretty dark. But there's always light. Light is always still there. In fact, let me show you how good spreads. Yeah, this is my baby right here. Okay, I, I need you guys to listen up. This is how good spreads. Let's read. How does good spread? Can we make the world brighter? Can we together make somebody's load lighter? Some people think good only spreads if you have lots of money. Or a nonprofit who makes a cool video that's slick and really funny. Yeah. Does good only spread when you have the right hashtag, or the right bracelet, or t-shirt, or give out free tote bags? Does good happen by accident, just out of the blue? Does good only spread when Beyonce allows it to? Queen Bee? She's pretty powerful, but wow, 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 so are you. The world's only seen a glimpse of what you can do. Your heart is so big, but you might feel so small. I'm telling you now, you're thinking as a flaw. <laughs> good spreads when good is spread. And that's totally how you live. You share and you love, and you give and give and give. If someone needs lifting, you send them a rope. Your little whispers of love sends out huge gusts of hope. I know what you're thinking. That's a nice little story you're reading, Kid President. But what about me? You wanna know how you can make good things spread in the world? Show up. Show up in the world, you'll be a light. You'll see work to be done on your left and your right. Like Caitlin, a girl who met people in need and started putting inspiring words on dusty old keys. Now she gives people jobs and second chances. She's filling the world with more and more dances. Or Ricky, a funny guy who wanted to share random acts of kindness everywhere. Communities are changing in Cleveland and tons of other places because Ricky just wanted to put smiles on folks' faces. I mean, there's other things too. Ever heard of Socktober? Well, Brad, the guy behind the camera here. But before we started all this cute president stuff, he started Socktober. He was just a guy who wanted to make a difference. He was just a sad, pale man. Hey, come on. <laughs> I'm sorry, it's just the truth. Well, anyway, he heard socks were one of the most needed, but least donated item in homeless shelters. Right when they're preparing in the winter months. There are over 600,000 men and women who are homeless in the United States. And some of them were children. He started telling some friends, and then they started telling some friends, and telling schools, and telling churches. And then the next year, grew even bigger. We started this little cute president project, and I invited some people to help out. Socktober! And you totally have. Socktober drives have happened all over the United States, in every single state, and on every single continent. That's the whole world, y'all. There's just a need. There's good to be done, and we're inviting people to do it. I guess that's just how good spreads. So how will you show up? How will you make things brighter? By loving the people next to you. And making your loads lighter. Anger is contagious. Hate and fear, they are too. But I'm not here to spread those. <laughs> and neither are you. We're here to spread hope and make the world dance. Open your eyes and your heart and we might stand a chance. Get out of your comfort zone and get out of your head. Get to loving people and good can't help but be spread. Honest Drama is proud to present their first production of the year. Once on this Island is a musical version of the classical and Romeo and Juliet. It takes place on an island. Performances are November 14th and 15th at 7 p.m. Tickets for the sale are $5. Advanced sales tickets will be available the week before the play in room 102 after school. For any questions, please see Ms. Dewitt or your nearest Honors Drama student. Are you expecting an item to be delivered to school? Don't forget to check your Google email for notices. 
regarding, regarding items being delivered to the front office. They will no longer call you down. You must check your email for the notification. Thursday Book Club is ready to start a new book. They will be reading Matched by Ali Kendar. New members are welcome to join them in room 806 on Thursday at 340. If you have any questions, please email Ms. Cumming or Mrs. Russo. Attention cross-country runners. We will be having a celebratory pizza party during lunch today from 1215 to 1230. If you have second lunch, you will be excused to join us. Make sure your jersey is turned, is turned into it is turned in to guarantee you an entry. Also, please bring your medals to the party. We would like to take some group pictures. Great job, on, great job on an amazing season. Any questions, please see Coach Botolato or Coach Swuggles. Dribble your way on down to this week's Friday activity, the hoop shoot. Bring a friend and, any challenge, and challenge them a round of hoop shots. Whoever makes the most baskets gets a piece of candy. Hey Huskies, show your support for our military and, veteran, and veterans by participating in our Patriotic Day and wearing red, white, and blue on Friday, November, November 9th. We would like to wish a happy birthday to Ms. Bozovo and Ms. Connor and Mr. Davis. Happy, happy birthday. birthday. Now let's head over to our special guest. Good morning, Huskies. Mr. Launder here. Happy Wednesday. Um, I just wanted to say thank you to everyone and all the kids I saw walk in the gates over the past few days with these giant boxes for the canned food drive. Um, it's so awesome to see so many of you trying to give back to the community and trying to help out families. I know November 16th is a fun day when we get to take everything over to Sunshine Haven um, and provide you know something for these families that they wouldn't have otherwise. Um, so I just wanted to say thank you for that. And then I hope today we have a great day out there um, and I look forward to seeing everyone.